Welcome to Local Outbreak on 100.1 The Planet, New Hampshire's Modern Rock. Matt from IPMNation.com. Back here again doing this uh, actually at The Planet with a brand new engineer. Tim Martin is working the board for us this week. And uh, Tim is uh, Tim has a great business, centralnhevents.com. Did I get that right? That's correct. Excellent. All right. So definitely check that out. And I'm sitting here with two members of Dark Minions. How are you guys? Very well. Pretty good. How's it going? Yourself? Good. Yeah. So we have John and Jason. Yep. And it is plural, right? Minions? Yes. yes. Okay. All right. Yes. Just making sure. More than one. <laughs> <laughs> cool. So we'll uh, we'll chat in a few minutes, but why don't we play a track? What do you guys want to open the show with? Uh, uh, you think Oblivion, dude? Oblivion sounds good. I like that. Oblivion. All right. So this is Oblivion from Dark Minions here on Local Outbreak.
Local outbreak on 100.1 The Planet, New Hampshire's Modern Rock. Matt sitting here with two of the members of Dark Minions. We have John and Jason. So what do you guys do in the band? I'm the singer. Okay. Vocals. Yeah, I play guitar. All right. And how many how many people are in the band total? Four. 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 Yeah. Where are the other guys? What's their excuse? Uh, my brother is the bass player. He's actually training up to go to Iraq right now. No kidding. So oh wow. Like, like another month he'll be overseas. Wow. So. Okay. Yeah. And who, are, uh, who else are we missing? Our the drummer, drummer which, Adam. Uh, we've, Adam. We've had issues. We uh, switched drummers, so now he's just working right now, and uh, that's why he can't be here. He's got to yep. pay the bills. Yep. Sure. He's got to make food. <laughs> so you had issues. Let's hear the dirt. What happened to the uh, old drummer? Uh, just not showing up. Couldn't make practices. You know? He liked yeah. women, which yeah. there's nothing wrong with women. Women are awesome. I like women, too. Yes. But he'd like blow off the band for, for his girl, which we only played one day a week. It's Was she hot? Hard. Not really. No. All right. It'd no, be an no. excuse if she was smoking. Sure, exactly. Right. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so uh so did he did he just not show up for practice or was he also not showing up for shows or uh, actually we had someone fill in for shows once. Yeah, we have, yeah. Down in Portland. Yeah. No kidding. Yeah. Had a few oh, friends wow. of ours. Back there was in other bands yeah. that could drum yeah. so they could do it on a dime, so why not? Yeah, yeah the whole show absolutely. was a nightmare, pretty much. How long ago did you switch drummers? Two years ago? Yeah. Okay. About two years now. Yeah. And is the rest of the band uh, original members? Uh, I mean, are, are, like, are you guys original members? We are the, the yeah, we are the yeah. original, yeah. Us okay. two are, definitely. Okay. But not the rhythm section? No. Yeah. Okay. No. Now, so your bass player is going to Iraq. When does he leave? Uh, he leaves, I believe, November 15th. He gets his boots in the dirt. No kidding. Um, he's training in Wisconsin right now. Yeah. And oh, okay. they're going to so give him a four-day pass, and then he goes over. So he's basically already... Yeah. yeah, he's, he's already he's, in. Yeah, yeah, no, he's, yeah, he's exactly. deployed currently right now. No Just kidding. Another month till he's over there. So. Yeah. yeah. So what's your plan? What are you guys going to do? Are you looking for a new bass player? Yeah, maybe just someone just to fill in until he gets sure. back. You know, maybe we can move them to rhythm guitar, you know, just something. Right, right. How yeah. long is he going for, do you know? Uh, right. He'll be back, I believe, September 20th-ish. Yeah. It's about a year full deployment, and he deployed September 11th. So yeah. the clock's been ticking since then. Right. So it's year. it's so weird because I don't know if you guys know Top Shelf Habit, but we had them on the show a few months ago. They're from Concord, okay. and it's the same thing. Their bass player <laughs> is shipping off to to the military. Oh, wow. no so kidding. they're they're wow. actually I don't know if they found somebody yet, but they've been looking for a temporary <laughs> replacement <laughs> wow. for for that's a while. Strange. He's gone. Yeah, yeah that's pretty yeah, cool. Though. He's, he's going overseas as well. So that's weird. And Jason, you were telling me earlier your dad kind of manages the band or did manage the band. Yes, but you're kind of taking over. Yep, he does. Uh, when we first started in uh, elementary school, we we're young, so he kind of took us under his wing and watched out for us. So he started managing us then, getting us gigs, and uh, since then he's been the the guy that really manages us, kind of mm -hmm. sets everything up. He's just the logistics part of us, I guess. No kidding. Yeah. So how long has the band been around then? About 11 years now. No yeah. kidding. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You guys are pretty young. So yeah. you guys, so you, you literally started this band in elementary school? Yeah, like eighth yep. grade. Eighth That's grade, really yeah. cool. For, yeah. Uh, yeah, we started, what was it for, uh, uh, what do they call talent contests? Yeah. We yeah. wanted to get some girlfriends. Yeah. Right, right. Now it's like, wow, we like music. Yeah. <laughs> so it, just it worked out. Kept well, going. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, that's the real reason everyone starts, exactly. right? You know, yeah, so yeah. Well, absolutely. It's for the girls. Fame and girls, yep. right? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Has the band always been called Dark Minions? Did you pick that name early um, on? Pretty, yeah, fairly early on. But, you know, we've gone through two different names. Yeah. Um, yeah. But that didn't last long. <laughs> We were known as uh, Joker. That was the first thing with we could the K backwards. Uh, yeah, <laughs> we were being risky, you know. Yes. Like, ooh, Switch edgy. It up. Yeah, <laughs> oh, that's awesome. That's what I. I was actually the drummer yeah, back then. You were bad. Oh, no kidding. Yeah, oh, yeah. oh, you were terrible. Oh, it was ridiculous. That's so, why he doesn't do it. So why did you move to vocals? Is that why? <laughs> oh yeah. Like, well, that's that's the thing. Him and yeah, uh, I don't. I'm not good at vocals. Yeah, but you are. Yeah, him and the other guitarist uh, who's not in the band anymore. Um, they started it up, and I was like, "I'm like, oh yeah, I can, I can play drums, you know, get me in there." <laughs> so, <laughs> that's, yeah, you know, I just joined up, and oh, yeah. they uh, soon fa found out I can't play drums. And I was like, "I can sing." Right. <laughs> so, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, it worked out. I can definitely sing much better. I can play drums any day. And how did you pick the name Dark Minions? Who came up with the name? Oh man, <sighs> we were trying to figure that out. <laughs> yeah, we can't it, really. It just came up to us, right? Yeah, just we just went. We were a Joker, and then uh, just. 
just went from you know at school we were hit me and jason were talking about uh you know we didn't like the, the word the name joker you right. know we wanted to switch it up we maybe become a different name the sabbath a lot yeah exactly you know, our yeah. whole mentality was that kind of yeah the 70s like rock stuff. and roll yeah so we wanted to be cool yeah. i guess right <laughs> yeah so that's that, <laughs> you don't really know it just kind of it's just how yeah it's exactly. like god reached down and said you are dark minions <laughs> <laughs> said, yes. was it god or satan satan, satan. correct <laughs> oh, <laughs> Wow, credibility out the window. <laughs> so, so your dad jumped in and started helping you guys when you were really young. Yeah, yeah. he really write cool. some of the songs. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, come up some of the ideas for the music parts. Um, yeah, is he also a musician? Yeah, he yeah. actually had a band before we were a band. He used to play, and I just we'd fill in for him once in a while when his band members didn't show up. Yeah. Oh no, kidding! Then yeah. we oh, got wow. really serious, and he decided to just kind of focus on us. Sure, yeah. he's encouraged us. I mean. A lot of parents are like, no, you can't be in a band. Yeah, exactly. Right. He kind of forced us. He didn't force us, but he's like, no, you guys. Yeah, he was want definitely to do the it, drive. You do it. No yeah, matter what we really can do, cool. you stick with it. That's really cool. Yeah, cool. that's awesome. Yeah. So you're kind of are you taking over the kind of the management part? You were saying yeah. Before we started um, yeah. just because he's working a lot, and yeah. now I'm kind of focused. Now I'm more focused. Now I'm not so young. I'm kind of like I figure if I really focus on it and push it. it It'll start going places, mm-hmm. and I want to be more involved than just playing music and you know writing songs. So sure, I sure. mean, still ask his advice. You know, have him call people when I need him to. Right, right. <laughs> Get numbers. So who mailed the CD here? Was that him or was that you? That was me. That was you. I actually, <laughs> heard I was hanging out with our old drummer, and I heard you guys on the radio uh, like a Sunday night, and I was like, "This is awesome!" You know, yeah. what is this? And because when we first started the band, you guys. Didn't have something like that. Right. There's nothing for there's us. Nothing for we local bands. Like, yeah. Just get out ago. there and play. We were pushing. There's nothing. Yeah. And we heard that. So it was like, let's do it. Yeah. You yeah. Know? Good. Well, I'm glad you did. Let's uh, let's play another track. What do you guys want to play from your from your disc? Uh, this one's called Inside of You. Inside yeah. of You. All right. Inside of You from Dark Minions here on Local Outbreak on 100.1 The Planet. Demon is mad. 
100.1 The Planet's Local Outbreak with IPMNation.com Local Outbreak on 100.1 The Planet, New Hampshire's Modern Rock. Matt from IPMNation.com sitting here with John and Jason from Dark Minions. So you guys um, kind of mentioned Sabbath earlier. What are your what are your influences? Uh, definitely Sabbath is a huge influence for both of us. Yeah. Uh, I grew up, my dad was playing the Paranoid Vinyl since I like, oh, yeah. I remember listening to that when I was like seven. Uh-huh. Black Label uh, Society is another one. Yeah, definitely. Um, uh, what else? I like Kill Switch. I know you like. Yeah, Kill Switch, Switch Rise Against. Yeah. Um, yeah. It's eclectic. We really like everything. Yeah, exactly. But uh, we definitely started off with the whole like Zeppelin, ACDC. Exactly. There's certain. I think every rock band, metal band, should have certain bands they listen to. Right. And those are kind of the standard. Just. Line them up, listen to them. Yeah. Alice in Chains. Yeah. Doors. Yeah. Who writes the tunes? Do you guys all write together? Uh, uh, basically, me and him do. Yeah. 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 He writes a lot of the lyrics, and I'm just the musical. I mean, I can write lyrics, but not as well as him. So. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I can't play any music instrument to save uh, my life, so. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> we learned that. Yeah. <laughs> So you have the, the disc that you have. Is that a demo, basically, or is that? Yeah. Or, I, I, don't, I don't know. Me, I see it as like a greatest hits. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we've been around we have so long. So many songs, like five albums. We've it's recorded. a ridiculous amount. Yeah. It's just yeah. a ridiculous That's amount of songs. But sure. I think those are basically the best ones that we think. Sure, are just top notch. How many? Yeah, you guys have been around a long time. How many <laughs> tunes do you guys have at uh, this point of original? I counted actually, dude. Is it it's over like 30? 40, 50. It's wow. like a little really? over fifty songs that we've actually recorded. That doesn't yeah. count what we've just played. Yeah, like exactly. Written and not recorded. Right. Yeah. When you play out, is it hard to kind of pare that down <laughs> with that? Uh, much yeah, material? yeah, it is. Yeah. <laughs> Because a lot, of, a lot of times we're like, well, you know, I like this song. Well, I don't want to play this song. You know, yeah. you always go back and forth. But you know, the main songs. Like are yeah. the best ones that we both, you know, yeah, right away there, we there's decide. There's certain songs you know that we're going right, to play. Exactly. We know because we like them. Right. And then, of course, we you find the filler songs. But right. We got so many to choose from. We could change it up every night. <laughs> yeah, that's the control. best part. A lot, of, a lot of them in rotation. Sure. You guys started so young. Are there any songs that you wrote in the beginning that you still play now? Oh yeah, really? Yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, there's, okay. there's not a lot, but there's definitely. I'd say a good ten to fifteen, you know. Yeah, I'd that say we definitely like psycho. We yeah, that study hall in in high school. <laughs> yeah, in no ninth kidding. grade, yeah. which is a long time ago. Yeah, and we, we re- replay re- that. Re- yeah, redo them, revamp them. You know, add solos. I was going to say they must yeah. evolve and change. Oh, exactly. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. We've yeah. recorded some songs like four times throughout <laughs> yeah. every album. Like, we go, we like we could do it better. Yeah, record it. Yeah, so it makes sense. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, do you guys do any covers as well? Or? Oh yeah! Oh yeah! yeah. Oh, what yeah. do you what do you do for covers? Uh, you can tell a lot about a band's influences from what they do for <laughs> Black Sabbath, <laughs> yeah. War Pigs, War Pigs, Pigs Paranoid. Uh, yeah, um, we've done a and Aerosmith ID. once. Yeah. yeah. Oh, what what Aerosmith uh, song? Sweet Emotion. Oh no, kidding! Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, Alice DC too. Yeah, we did Queen of the Rodeo. Yeah. 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 Alice yeah. Cooper. Yeah. God, there's just so many. <laughs> Pretty much, we used to just ask people, "What do you want to hear?" Right. Exactly. Then we go out and learn it. You yeah. know, it was do, fun. Do you guys play out a lot? play a lot of shows or uh, not recently yeah, but not recently we yeah we played when we were uh, a few years ago we were playing in manchester every month yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, every single month in manchester, we played in boston, boston we played in portland, portland. all over yeah. every little dive you could think of every little the i think the best is the middle east club in cambridge yeah right? that was, yeah boston. that was a really good one yeah. blood for really blood nice which we love yeah actually recorded an album there and we got to actually record an album there too oh, yeah. for cool. a festival so we were like sweet we shared the stage with them yeah. uh, nice american head charge we played at the bomb shelter yeah right before yeah. they did yeah exactly that was cool Oh, you guys played at the bomb shelter. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I used to, I, I've probably seen you guys at some point before then and just don't even... Yeah, we played there, yeah. played there a few times. One time yeah. we got there, we were escorted out. Uh, <laughs> we had a little rivalry with a, fr- a band. Yeah. Uh, they didn't like us. We didn't like them. What band? Uh, 
God, I, I wish I could remember. tell you the name, but I don't it was remember. A while them. ago. Oh, really? Yeah, but yeah. We, we, def- we couldn't we, stay for the rest of the show. We, that was really? it. Yeah, we played our yeah. set. It started getting really rowdy. Yeah. They escorted us out the side, out the back door. We had armed escorts out, like not armed, but like like bodyguard kind of guys, like watching us, helping us move the equipment, getting us out. We couldn't stay for the show because the crowd, was their there? fans didn't like us, and our fans uh, liked us, so it was like very tense atmosphere. Right. No kidding. Yeah. yeah. We had an altercation with the band. Well, probably a few shows before what we the one in Manchester, yeah, you know, where they were knocking our equipment over. You know, they're just getting really? too rowdy, and we're like, "Well, yeah. you know, just calm down." Yeah. And we try to be classy. About uh, yeah, it, but <laughs> our fans are kind of something about a Minions fan is uh, they're diehard. Yeah, yeah. they oh, like yeah. this, so they start stuff. The pit gets bad. It gets more of a not friendly pit to a. <laughs> yeah. They're actually being violent. Yeah, yeah. So they wanted that to stop violent real quick. Yeah. <laughs> so did Surge throw you guys out or what? It, it wasn't like a throw out, no. really. It was more of a, it'd just be a better idea for you to get out of here so no one gets hurt. Right, right. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. You know yeah. I mean? It was just good for business. I mean, no hard feelings. Or no. Just, yeah, yeah. It no, was not getting at all. rowdy. <laughs> yeah, it was just ridiculous. <laughs> Interesting. No kidding. No kidding. Now, how come you guys haven't played out as much lately? Have you been busy recording? or well, uh, one with the d- Dusty going to Iraq. Yeah. So, you know, we oh, okay. took a little break with that. Yeah, two and, years uh, ago, me, my brother, and my sister joined the Army. Yeah. So me and my brother left. Yeah. And we came, We were gone for like a year and a half, so we stopped playing. Yeah. And uh, we came back. We started. We, we haven't played out since then, mm-hmm. but we've started practicing again, you know. Yeah. yeah. S- stuff like that, I guess, huh? Yeah. Pretty much. You nailed it. <laughs> yeah, you know. <laughs> so what? What's the plan for the future? Are you guys gonna start doing more shows? Are you gonna? Oh, I'd love to. I'd love out. to start playing out again. Yeah, that'd be fantastic. Yeah. I was thinking of taking over the world with our music. <laughs> that's, that's my right. ultimate goal. <laughs> yeah, that's good to me. You know, yeah. promote, promote us like you yeah. would believe. Push, push, push. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, Definitely. Yeah. Cool. Well, why don't we play another track? What do you guys want to play? Uh, let's see. What was that other song? Oh, Honest Man. This is a good song. It's got a good story, too. Really? What's the story? Yes. Uh, well, I can't really get into the details, per se, but if you listen to the lyrics, you can figure it out. It has to do... It's a true story written on my brother, the bass player. Mm-hmm. He had a issue with a, a fine young female when he was younger mm-hmm. and uh, kind of got a little legal involved a little bit that's i think really? the only thing yeah. we can say about it but the song lyrics definitely tell the story <laughs> yeah, yeah exactly. sure yeah <laughs> yeah all right well everyone listen carefully then <laughs> this is honest man from dark minions here on local outbreak on 100.1 the planet <laughs>
Local outbreak on 100.1 The Planet, New Hampshire's Modern Rock. Matt from IPMNation.com sitting here with John and Jason from Dark Minions. So where do we find you guys online for people who want to keep up with what you're doing? And You know, Facebook, uh, MySpace, mm-hmm. uh, Dark Minions, just search it. Definitely can find it. Yeah, yeah. come up on Easily. Google. I tried it. Did you? It's awesome. Excellent. <laughs> We're the first link. It's like, bam, you can even hit I'm Feeling Lucky. Really? Okay. Yeah, I'm Feeling Lucky, Dark Minions... There we are. That's awesome. We're going to own a casino. Oh, yeah. Cool. Uh, do you have on the MySpace, do you have a bunch of your tunes? Or? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yes. Okay. We do, we do. Yep. Outstanding. Even on Facebook. Old ones and new ones. Well, maybe not new ones. New, newer to us, I guess. Sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sure. Cool. Do you have any music on your Facebook page? Or We do. Yep. Yeah. yeah. We uploaded, what was it, like five, six songs? Yeah. Yeah, because some people try to put music on Facebook and they get frustrated. I guess right. they don't make yeah. it easy. <laughs> yeah, it was, no, it too that's why he really? does it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. John's good at computers. that stuff. He's, you, he's you the handle the web guru. stuff, John. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, pretty much. Yeah. yeah, no, that's cool. That's yeah. cool. That's important. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, are you guys on any other sites too, or are you just sticking to the basics for now? That's about it for now. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty high tech for us. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you know, pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> excellent, excellent. Well, guys, thanks very much for being here with oh, us. Thank you for week. having us. Oh, definitely, absolutely, definitely, time. definitely like the tunes a lot. And and uh, once you get back out there, I look forward to seeing you live. Cool, awesome, so awesome, awesome. definitely. Oh, and I want to thank uh, Tim Martin once again for engineering the show this week. Welcome, welcome to the show, Tim. Thank you. And uh, be sure to check out Central. NHEvents.com? Yes. Yes. CentralNHEvents.com. <laughs> Nailed that one. <laughs> I got to get used to that because I was so used to saying, you know, the stuff I used to say. You, right. You'll get so fast, you'll be like a race car driver. you just be like, I'd like to thank Good Ranch. La, 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 la. You, you get it. <laughs> That's what happens eventually. Yes, absolutely. Um, which is good because one of my long term goals is to be an auctioneer. Oh, so people are- excellent. I made that up. But. Uh, I, I'm pulling for you. <laughs> Maybe start nice. with bingo and then. I'll, yeah, I'll work my way up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's cool. Touche. All right, guys. Well, thanks a lot. John and Jason from Dark Minions, what do you want to wrap up the show with? <sighs> uh, slower tune called The Road. Yeah. The Road. Yes. All right, very good. This is The Road from Dark Minions here on Local Outbreak on 100.1 The Planet. And I almost forgot to mention, stick around. Coming up after this show is Out of the Box with Amber Cool. All right, thanks, everybody. See you next week.
the planet's local outbreak with ipmnation.com The planet's local outbreak is recorded weekly at the studios of 100.1 The Planet. It's engineered by Tim Martin of centralnhevents.com. Matt Connerton of ipmnation.com is the host of The Planet's local outbreak. The show is produced and edited by Annie Biello of 100.1 The Planet. For artist links and details about The Planet's local outbreak, Log on to the Planet's Entertain Me page, WPNHFM.com. The Planet's local outbreak is available for download anytime online, IPMNation.com slash local outbreak. The Planet's local outbreak is a product of 100.1 The Planet and Northeast Communications.